recording this video right now, I'm going to show a very brief video clip as, a, as an example of the hypnosis inhibiting my ability to speak. All right, so that was a very extreme example. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pull up some uh, information I'm going to be reading very quickly. So as you can see, I'm hypnotized to feel pain, and I'm being tortured and abused relentlessly with hypnosis like an Ultra experiment. Since the video clip is extremely compelling evidence that hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak, it's more important to pay attention to how much the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak, um, instead of if the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak. To make the hypnotic commands less noticeable, most of the hypnotic commands are designed to only inhibit my ability to speak as much as my ability to speak could be inhibited without being too noticeable. I was sentenced to inhibit my ability to speak and articulate complete sentences that included my victim's statement report or victim testimonial, and the hypnotic commands typically interrupted sentence articulation after only 39 words to prevent me from articulating complete sentences. Um, <clears throat> also, the difficulty pronouncing the word uh, articulating even was also the hypnosis. So, I was sanitized to experience pain and physical strain speaking as a method of delaying the completion of my victim testimony. I'm going to be raising my index finger to indicate when pain is being triggered with hypnosis to delay or prolong my victim testimonial. This can, um, <clears throat> sorry about that. You can see the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak. I was, in, I was hypnotized to experience pain and physical strain as a method of delaying the completion of my victim testimonial. I'm going to be raising my index finger to indicate when pain is being triggered with hypnosis delay or prolong my victim testimonial. This can effectively be used as evidence that the pain is noticeably correlated with a decreased rate of how many words per minute are articulated in my victim testimonial. I was also hypnotized to feel pain and then sent to coerce me into saying profanities during my videos as a method of deterring others from watching my videos so that I could abuse, be abused with less witnesses. The pain is being used as a form of deterrent to punish me by incriminating my perpetrators. At, um, sorry, you can see it right now. So the pain is being used as a form of deterrent to punish me by incriminating my perpetrators because I am punishing them. It's important um, it's, it's important to pay attention during the video if the pain is triggered by incriminating my perpetrators or to slow down the rate I'm articulating and completing my victim testimonial. So um, this is essentially the double bind that I'm going to be putting the hypnosis in to identify how much the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak. We can objectively measure how much the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak by averaging how many words per minute I can articulate to include in my victim statement report and criminal investigation report. Since the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to articulate more than 39 words of my victim testimonial at a time, if I am articulating less than 39 words per minute of my victim testimonial, it would be an effective measurement and an indication of hypnotically impaired speech. So, um, anyways, I'm... Um, I gotta do this quickly because this is uh, really sick and twisted what they've been doing to me. So I'm going to be setting a timer too. So I'm going to set this for, let's say, uh, five minutes. So, you know, I should at least have a few more sentences articulated in my victim test of my victim testimonial within that period of time. And you can see the hypnosis is inducing pain. All right, anyways, moving on here, moving on, moving on. I shouldn't be in pain, I shouldn't be in pain, I shouldn't be in pain, I shouldn't be in pain. Be in 
Let's see. So what I have articulated already initially, the hypnotic metaphor and process social role that I was a movie actor and celebrity spokesperson for the Make-A-Wish Foundation to replace the victim, the abuse victim and medical malpractice patient social roles. The imposed social roles were obviously fabricated, although threats, intimidation, and abuse were utilized to coerce compliance with the role expectations. The imposed role expectations implied that my celebrity personality was supposed to be similar to G-Eazy, a charismatic, young, energetic, fun-loving, and carefree celebrity, as opposed to a traumatized victim of abuse. So, um... Anyways, moving on here. I should not be in any pain for this. This is ridiculous. Mm-hmm. Okay. Anyway, sorry. Um. See how um it's um I'm trying to articulate a sentence in my victim testimonial. See the way that I'm acting. This is ridiculous. This is abuse. This is abuse. This is abuse. Initially, the hypnotic metaphor imposed a social role that I was a movie actor. Okay, so moving on. I need to actually articulate a sentence. You can see it's not supposed to be physically strenuous when you do this. This is absolutely absurd and ridiculous. I graduated high school year early, started college year early. Honor roll student. No problems, difficulties at all whatsoever. I didn't even have to try. So this is about the real expectations, um, and like, uh, so, you know, um, the, So um, the role expectations are elaborated in section four. Um, what was section four? It was like um, something about, uh, it was like conditioning and something else. I can't remember what specifically. I'm going to have to take a quick look. Brainwashing and conditioning, okay. Subsection. So you can see the gnosis is torturing me right now. The gnosis is torturing me. That gnosis is torturing me. This is not okay. Futurama threats metaphor. Okay. Oh, make a wish threats and Futurama threats. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and restart that timer. Okay, the role expectations are elaborated in detail in section four, brainwashing and conditioning subsection, make a wish threats and Futurama threats. Um, 
in further detail. And this is uh, specifically the movie actor and celebrity spokesperson for the Make-A-Wish Fund. It's a long social role. So I'm going to just say, call it the uh, celebrity and uh, movie actor. Rural expectations are elaborated in further detail in section four. Um, brainwashing and conditioning, subsection, make a wish threats and Futurama threats. And then, um, uh, I, I, uh, but that, it's not supposed to be physically painful for me to talk. It's not supposed to be physically painful. It's not supposed to be physically painful. Um, and, um, see, like, uh, this is where, um, you know, I'm trying to just articulate the next sentence of my victim testimonial. Um, so about, uh, being a, uh, um, celebrity and a movie actor. So, uh, um, the imposed The imposed role expectations oh, okay so what I can do I, um, that can be the last sentence of this particular um, like subsection of the section right subsection of the subsection of the subject section anyways um, The celebrity and movie actor role expectations role expectations role role expectations And so it's not supposed to be painful at all. This is just evidence that hypnosis torture me. That hypnosis is torture me. That hypnosis is torture me. That hypnosis is torture me. I don't have to. I don't have to deal with this. I do not have to deal with this. The celebrity and movie actor role. Um. Oops. Rotation mark in the wrong place. There we go. Movie actor. End quote, role expectations. So, um, the celebrity and movie actor role expectations imposed or a social role imposed role expectations. See how I'm like, uh, not you know, um, abnormally tense and everything along those lines right now because of, um, it became too obvious. Um, that the hypnosis was being used to abuse me, you know, as much as they can get away with. Is how much they're trying to abuse me. So the celebrity movie actor social role imposed role expectations. So I shouldn't be getting abused at all, obviously. The celebrity and movie actor social role imposed role expectations that... Um, see, uh, how many words is that? How many words is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Five minutes for that. The celebrity and movie actor social role imposed role expectations. I'm being tortured right now. I'm being tortured. I'm being tortured. This is not okay. This is not okay. This is not okay. This is not okay. I'm being tortured. I am being tortured. I'm not okay with it. 
was supposed to be similar. Um, the celebrity and movie movie actor social role imposed role expectations that. Uh, like I shouldn't should not be having any difficulty articulating this. I should not be having any difficulty, and I shouldn't be having any difficulty. The celebrity and movie actor social role imposed role expectations that you can see how much the hypno how much the gnosis is abusing me, since we've all already established that obviously the gnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak. It's just about how much the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak. The celebrity and mo movie actor social role imposed role expectations that. Why, like, it's not supposed to be physically strenuous. It's not, it's not supposed to be physically strenuous. It's not, this is, um, it's, I, like, uh, see the, like, um, I'm not, I'm not covering for the, I'm not concealing how the, the post traumatic suggestions, I don't have to, they need to go to prison for it. The celebrity and movie actor, social role and post role expectations that, Okay, this is about not, um, like, uh, acting like I've been, ab not, um, being abused or having medical malpractice. Um, not having medical conditions and, um, basically being about, um, you can see the, uh, this is absolutely absurd. Like, I'm just trying to talk and the hypnosis is torturing me. Um, this is, uh, like, why I shouldn't be, like, moving around so much or shaking. So, um, and it imposed role expectations that, um... So like I was supposed to be similar to G Easy, right? Fun loving, you know. Um, I was supposed to um, because they were torturing me, and they wanted to make the torture look like I was having fun instead of being tortured. The celebrity and movie actor social role imposed role expect. I should not be in any pain. I shouldn't be in pain. See, like, uh, I'm also hypnotized to snap my fingers, too, when I'm uh, trying to force the hypnosis to, like, allow me to do something that it's trying to inhibit me from doing, which is just further evidence of the situation. Articulate the damn sentence for the fucking testimonial. Why is that so... Why was that so physically strenuous for me to say? The celebrity movie actor, social role imposed role expectations that... I was supposed to behave act act in a movie and blindly obey the hypnotic commands and hypnotic metaphors And act like I was having fun. And, um, uh, you can see that Gnosis is torturing me. I'm trying to articulate this a uh, specific way that I just want to articulate it to. Um, and the Gnosis is torturing me for it. Uh, I don't have to do this. I don't have to be in pain. I don't have to be in pain. And I do not have to be in pain. I do not have to care. I don't like...
See the hypnosis is torture me right now. This is evidence of it. The celebrity and movie actor's social role imposed role expectations that I was supposed to act in a movie and blindly obey the hypnotic commands and hypnotic metaphors and act like. See how the hypnosis interrupted my sentence? That's what the pain is for. They're torturing me. But I was supposed to be acting in a movie and blindly obey the hypnotic commands and hypnotic metaphors. Um, regardless of whether or not the hypnotic commands and metaphors Regardless of whether or not these instructions seemed illogical or irrational. See how long that took me to do, and I should not be in pain at all whatsoever. Um, next sentence, next sentence, next sentence. The hypnosis has interrupted me again. I like see how I cringed there in pain because the hypnosis tortured me interrupt me from complete articulating the next sentence for the victim testimonial. I'm just trying to articulate the next sentence for the victim testimonial. That's all I'm trying to do. That is all I'm trying to do. It's not supposed to be excruciatingly painful to do. I'm just articulating sentences. Why is it taking me so long? Why is it taking me so long? It should not be taking me this long. Um, I'm being tortured. This is not okay. 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 So I shouldn't be in pain just for trying to articulate. Okay, so since I can't feel pain, now I can't talk in complete sentences or, you know, articulate complete words. I can only stutter with them. We're going to prison for an extremely long time. I am using this video as evidence. I don't care about them at all. This is evidence of it. Regardless of whether or not these instructions seem lot illogical or irrational. Or I could say even say uh, regardless of the instructions. Seeming to be illogical and or irrational. Um, these movie actor the movie actor role expectations social role imposed similar role expectations to that of It's, um, you know, like been that amount of words and then you can see that I cringed in pain there. So that's just further evidence of what I'm saying exactly. It should be very, very easy and simple for me to be able to articulate the next, you know, um, the next few sentences. Why can't I even articulate a complete sentence? Movie actor social role and post similar role expectations to that of... <sighs> the social role... of contestants on game shows um, and I can do this uh, game show contestants there we go
And um, so, like, uh, this is a... Uh, so, uh, but, but, no, no, uh, the movie actor... Movie actor, so the movie actor social role imposed similar role expectations to that of the social roles of game show contestants. See how I can't articulate the next words in the victim testimonial? It's inhibiting my ability to complete sentences in my victim testimonial. It's interrupting me. It's interrupting me, and I'm trying to finish the sentence for my victim testimonial. I can't. Why have I not been like? Um, this is very evident. And just the simple fact that I haven't been able to articulate a singular sentence, a singular complete sentence without being interrupted with pain and cringing because of the hypnosis torturing and abusing me to inhibit my ability to speak. The movie actor social role imposed similar role expectations to that of the social role of social roles of game show contestants. Um, whereas game show contestants are expected. Whereas the social role expectations whereas the expectations imposed on the social roles imposed on the social roles Or I could say, like, uh, whereas I'm um, compliant to the instructions, is expected in order to when, when. And like, I mean, on game shows, like it could be like money or whatever, right? Some, something of value. Um, whereas compliance to the instructions is expected in order to. So, um, I, 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 I'm, I, I, you know, I'm just trying to articulate the rest of the sentence and the gnosis is torturing me for it. The gnosis is torturing me for trying to articulate the rest of the sentence. I shouldn't be cringing or in pain at all whatsoever if we're trying to articulate the rest of the sentence. Whereas compliance to the instructions is expected in order to, to, when, um, when prizes, Prizes or awards um, Like all I'm trying to explain though is because uh, I mean, you know the uh, but, but, I'm sorry I'm trying to talk in the hypnosis is torture me. This is not okay. This is not okay. This is not okay This is not okay. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this up here because I talk about um Game show presupposition in here. Game show. There we go. Game show patterns, sponsorships. I'm going to go ahead and grab this here because uh, this kind of explains a lot of it. See how sick and twisted these people are that are abusing me with hypnosis? Um, you can tell that like um, these people are some of the most disgusting and worthless psychopaths to ever disgrace the face of the earth and the human race so I was sanitized to think I contracts and sponsorships with various companies to advertise their products by using their products in my movie I was also sanitized to think I was supposed to receive fabricated incentives for complying with the post hypnotic suggestions and hypnotic metaphors. Um,
movie actor social role imposed so, um, similar role expectations to that of game show contestants. You see him shouldn't be in pain at all whatsoever. I shouldn't be in pain. I shouldn't be in pain. And it's evidence of it. So, you know, I'm basically um, coercing the hypnosis to uh, stop inducing pain because I'm, it's just evidence. So let's see here. The movie actor social role imposed similar expectations. And it's, um, you know, I'm also pointing out how much the hypnosis is abusing me. And inhibiting me because I, it shouldn't be abusing me or inhibiting me at all. Um, we've already established that it is. The movie actor social role imposed similar role expectations that of game show contestants. The the role expectations so like uh, let's see here All right, so, um, and uh, celebrity spokesperson, um, social roles, so, like, uh, I want to read this entire thing. I was sanitized to think I had contracts and sponsorships with various companies to advertise their products by using their products in my movie. I was also sanitized to think I was supposed to receive fabricated incentives for complying with post hoc suggestions and hypnotic metaphors. This game show reality show presupposition of the movie plot was a method of creating an excuse to use punishment for resisting and defying post hoc suggestions. Um, this kind of reminds me of like, uh, you know, when... For example, um, in game shows when, like, contestants would lose, um, and then they would, like, they could even receive, like, some form of punishment. Um, and I remember on, like, uh, Nickelodeon, that could have been considered the slime. <laughs> um, you know, of course, that's, like, a more of a kid's type of theme, right? But, um, yeah, so, like, uh, I shouldn't be in pain. The movie actor and celebrity spokesperson social roles impose similar role expectations to that of game show contestants. The role expectations Ah, there we go. All right. Um, uh, th by the way, I also was interrupted before being able to finish what I was reading. And I shouldn't be in pain for it. Um, the game show presupposition imposed that the movie scenes and hypnotic metaphors were like puzzles, quizzes, or challenges on a game show, and that I only had one chance to make the movie scene, so it was important that I blindly obeyed the instructions and the nest loop metaphors and didn't question the instructions because I would not be able to retake the movie scenes, um, which is like their, which was basically their excuse for using punishment. Um, the incomplete metaphors. which was their excuse for punishing me which was the excuse they used for punishing me um because the movie production, because um, it was, a, it was, it was, it was costing money.
um, because it was um, too expensive. I was sanitized to think the movie production was expensive. I was sanitized to think these movie scenes were too expensive. Um, to, uh, like, uh, to waste them or, um, you know, to not, um, <clears throat> um, to do retakes or, you know, I mean, like retakes weren't exactly like an option because it was supposed to be like a recorded live type of thing, right? Um, that's the presupposition that they imposed, but... And regardless of such, it's not nice to think these movie scenes were too expensive um, to produce. Um, and uh, and I was sanitized to think the reason they punished me. For not complying was because the movie scenes were too expensive to produce because the movie scenes were too expensive to make. Um, so anyways, I'm being tortured right now. I'm being tortured. I'm being tortured. I shouldn't be in pain. I shouldn't be in pain. I, I shouldn't be in pain. I shouldn't be in pain. I shouldn't be in pain. I was enticed to think they punished me for not complying um, because the movie scenes were too expensive and could not be retaken. There we go. That That's better. Um... And um, the movie scenes cannot be retaken. There we go. That's more grammar. So as I I think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes were too expensive and movie scenes were, could not be retaken. Um, let me see here. So the game the game show presupposition imposed that the movie scenes and hypnotic metaphors were like puzzle quizzes were challenges on a game show and that I only had one chance to make the movie scene so it was important that I blindly obeyed the instructions in the nested loop metaphors and didn't question the instructions because I would not be able to retake the movie scenes. I was sanitized to think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes were too expensive and the movie scenes could not be retaken. The incomplete metaphors were um, similar to choosing prizes behind curtains on a game show where the answer wouldn't be revealed until after I made my decision and the necessarily hypnotic metaphor would be completed. So a lot of these kind of things were like uh, puzzles, right? Um,
Um, so like, uh, and uh, <clears throat> it's this last sentence. This is specifically how they basically made that type of uh, presupposition, right? Because um, that's how they really conditioned me, right? Um, like they coerce, because uh, it's coercive conditioning um, or brainwashing to instill the belief that I was making a movie. So, you know, if I didn't comply, I was punished. Um, and if I complied, um, then there would be a, um, the nested metaphor would provide an explanation that would later make sense. Um, So the incomplete metaphors were similar to choosing prizes hidden behind curtains on a game show where the answer wouldn't be revealed until after I made my decision. And then the nested loop hypnotic metaphor would be completed. So, um, like, uh, like a confusion tactic, um, kind of, um, a lot of the concepts, same concepts of like no sets and then, um, like, uh, it was a method of uh, punishing resistance because um, they would try to make me feel stupid for not complying to the incomplete hypnotic metaphors. Um, and then you can see that the hypnosis is torturing me right now. Um, ow, 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 ow. I shouldn't be in pain. 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 The sentence likes to think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes were too expensive and I shouldn't be um, tensing at all whatsoever. Ow, ow, ow. And the movie scenes could not be retaken. The sentence likes to think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes were too expensive and the movie scenes could not be retaken. Um, the incomplete metaphors were similar to choosing... Um, so the incomplete metaphors... I can say this, incomplete metaphors and nested loop metaphors. Hypnotic metaphors were used to condition and create this presupposition, this, uh, the game show presupposition, The incomplete metaphors were similar to choosing prizes behind curtains on a game show where the answer wouldn't be revealed until after I made my decision, and then the nested loop hypnotic metaphor would be completed. And um, I have an example here that I'm going to be um, specifically quoting because, um, see, the thing I like about it is that it um, exposes how sick they are and twisted they are and how much they abused and tortured me with hypnosis. So let's see here. I was also enticed to think I was supposed to receive fabricated incentives for complaint. I'm going to take this part out. Wait. No, I'm not. Um. Because a lot, of, I'm I'm basically just copying and pasting a majority of this. That's like um, um, even like uh, further evidence. I'm not even really articulating very much. It's ridiculous. I'm just being tortured. This celebrity movie actor social role imposed role expectations that I was supposed to be acting in the movie and blindly obey them. Not a commands and hypnotic metaphors, regardless of the instructions, seeming to be illogical and or ir irrational. Um. So uh, let's see. I was sanitized to think I had contracts and sponsorships with various companies to advertise their products by using their products in my movie. I was also sanitized to think I was supposed to receive fabricated incentives for combining with hypnotic with the post hypnotic suggestions and hypnotic metaphors. Um.
Okay, because that other sentence was, uh, in this sentence I'm basically taking out, right? Oh, wait, um, yeah. The celebrity and movie actor are so for all imposed all expectations that are supposed to be acting in a movie. And blindly obey the hypnotic commands and not when hypnotic metaphors, regardless of the instructions, seem to be illogical and or irrational. Um, So, um, and, uh, this was used, okay, so I, blind, um, the game show, show presupposition imposed that the movie scenes and hypnotic metaphors were like puzzles, Ooh, challenges. I was hypnotized to think they punished me for not complying, um, to the, uh, like, uh, to the hypnotic, um, So yeah, that hypnosis is torturing me right now. It's torturing me. It's torturing me. It's torturing me. It's torturing me. I'm being tortured. I'm being tortured. I am being tortured. I am being tortured. This is see, so like yeah, uh, I'm being tortured. 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 This is abuse. This is abuse. See, like I shouldn't be in any pain at all whatsoever. By the way, I even covered up my face, um, post an oxygen suggestion. I noticed it too. So they need to go to prison for that. Um, this game show, uh, t- speaking of punishment, right? I can't wait to punish them. This game show reality show presupposition of the movie plot was a method of creating an excuse to use punishment for resisting and defying post an suggestions, enabling them to abuse me and then blaming it, it on me. Um... So I could even take that part, cut it. And if I put it at here, um, so I can go ahead and start reading this in just a second. I'm just being like, I'm, oh, I'm trying to talk, I'm trying to talk, and I'm trying to talk, I'm trying to talk. The Gnosis is torturing me. The Gnosis is inhibiting me. The Gnosis is inhibiting me. The game show presupposition imposed that the, wait, what the hell? Oh, that's where it was. That's why. You could even see that I was tensing up and I, um, you know, was in pain too for uh, resisting it because, um, anyways, I was sanitized to think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes were too expensive and the movie scenes could not be retaken as an excuse to use punishment for resisting and defying post mark suggestions, enabling them to abuse me and then blaming it on me. See how sudden and rapid that my entire disposition just changed? I was sanitized to think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes are too expensive and the movie scenes could not be retaken. Um, as an excuse, um, to use punishment for resisting and defying post mark suggestions, um, enabling them to abuse me and then blaming it, um, and then um, claiming it was my fault. They were, they had to punish me. I 
and then blaming me for being at fault. For them punishing me. Because they were punishing me. I'm going to actually say this when they were abusing me. All right. Okay, so, um, I shouldn't be in pain, 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 and I shouldn't be in pain. Let me see here, um, Pastor. I, I, I like, you know, I just need to get this done quickly. Uh, I'm, that, I'm, I just see how I like. I uh, the hypnosis is inhibiting my ability to speak right now. So the game show reality show presupposition of the movie plot was a method of creating. Um, let me see. I can take this part out completely, probably. Cut. Move it down here and probably paste. See, like I, I was supposed to finish. Like this is there. Um, this is um, an example of how they're dra dragging out and prolonging me from being able to complete something that should not take me long at all to complete at all whatsoever. And especially where I had to rearticulate very minor details and sentences, um, just to try to discredit how much, um, you know, they in were inhibiting my ability to speak because of you know. Like, uh, makes it a little bit complicated with doing a word count. But, um, you know, with just the re-articulated sentences, I'm not going to be including that um, because I don't have to. Um, it doesn't change the fact of how much, um, how many sentences I did articulate that are being used and that were not copied and pasted or just simply revised. Um, so the revisions aren't going to be included, but, but the video is almost an hour long, too. And you can see that, like, uh, you know, um, I'm like, uh, that, 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 that hypnosis has been, um, I, I was hypnotized to talk in circles because they were torturing and abusing me relentlessly with hypnosis, and they just wanted to be able to keep torturing and abusing me and be able to get away with it. And, I mean, as you can see, like, you know, I'm able to articulate, and act, I'm actually very speaking very quickly and far above average the rate, and then, um, you know, you could even see that I was in a test of real pain, to slow down the rate that I was speaking. These people are sick, disgusting psychopaths. I was sanitized to think I had a contract. Uh, what? Um, see, like, uh, I'm just trying to find where I was quickly, and I'm being tortured for it. The game show presupposition imposed that the movie scenes and hypnotic metaphors were like puzzles. Quizzes or challenges on a game show, and they're only one chance to make a movie scene, so it's important that I don't know the instructions and the nice little metaphors, and I and didn't question the instructions because I would not be able to take on movie scenes. See how uh, it was physically strenuous for me to be able to complete that sentence? I was sanitized to think they punished me for not complying because the movie scenes were too expensive, and the movie scenes could not be really taken as an excuse to use punishment for resisting and defying customer suggestions, enabling them to abuse me and then blaming me for being at fault when they were abusing me. 
Incomplete metaphors and nested loop hypnotic metaphors were used to condition and create the presupposition. The game show presupposition. So it was compared to like, um, you know, like uh, completing puzzles and things along those lines. Let me see here. Anyways, um, So I shouldn't be in any pain, I shouldn't be in any pain, and I shouldn't be in any pain, I'm just doing this quickly. And I shouldn't be like cringing in pain just because I'm doing it quickly. <clears throat> so, um, you know, because it's being used, it's been used as punishment to try to slow me down and distract my attention while I was trying to do something so that I would slow down. But, you know, I'm just using it to punish them now. Um, well, I mean, I'm using it to expose, I'm using it as evidence to... Um, convict them so that I can punish them in the court of law um, very severely and harshly and, you know, mercilessly. So then, um, I'm, uh, a bit, bit. so like, I, I'm going to also include a sentence here that's like, you know, I'm just going to be including, um, this, uh, from the game show, pre, um, from the subsection, you know, on game show presuppositions. Um, And I, I shouldn't be painful for me to um, articulate the sentence. It's just not supposed to be painful, and it's not supposed to be painful. 
All I'm trying to explain is the game show presupposition. It's not a difficult concept to understand. It's not a difficult concept to understand. See, like, um, a, better, a faster, 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 faster. So, like, you know, this is uh, basically copied and pasted from that, right? So, like, this is a section from this, you know, um, the following segment from the, uh, you know, game show. Wow, I'm being tortured. What is the word excerpt? If that's even how it's pronounced, I'm not sure. What's it called? Excerpt. 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 Okay. Um. I am including a brief excerpt excerpt from section four section four it's the brainwashing and conditioning subsection and then that's the game show Is a position. It's not supposed to be painful. So you know, like uh, uh, even also, but I'm being tortured. 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 I'm, being tortured, I'm, being tortured, I'm not getting, getting, getting away with it. See, like it shouldn't be painful at all. Game show patterns slash sponsorships. That was it. Sorry about that. I am including a brief excerpt from section four, brainwashing and conditioning, subsection, um, game show patterns slash sponsorships, um, which uh, describes the um, impl imposed role expectations, which um, elaborates, which explains some of these, um, which explains some of the Role expectations. Okay. All right, I should not be in pain. I shouldn't 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 be in pain. Okay. So I was all sanitized to crack my back just barely too, because I've been uh, getting tortured and abused with hypnosis and they're trying to conceal it.
Okay, so I do want to kind of update this uh, here in the main document that I have before I would forget. So today's date is what, um, April 4th, 23, I don't want to say the day that it changes my tail, just because. All right, and then I also wanted to include here, um, <clears throat> so like, you know, they punished me for trying to talk about like, uh, you know, medical malpractice and abuse. Um, So, um, oh, that's right. Um, so like, uh, you know, um, primarily the main thing, right? Um, <clears throat> So like, uh, since this was all fabricated, hmm. and then I can even include that part in it too. Okay, so, um, since the since the celebrity and movie actor role expectations were fabricated. This primarily was used as a distraction. Like, uh, you know, so like this involved a lot of brainwashing and distraction, but um, like I'm try trying to explain it and the hypnosis is torturing me for it and I shouldn't be in pain for it. I shouldn't be in pain and I shouldn't be in pain and I shouldn't be in pain and I should not be in pain. 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 I'm sick of being tortured. I'm sick of being tortured. I'm sick of being tortured. 
I was enticed to think I had contracts and sponsorships with various companies to advertise their products by using their products in my movie. Um, so, uh, like, uh, the um, game show patterns and sponsorships. That's how I can articulate it. That's great. So then... Um, patterns and uh, slash sponsorships. I'm also advertised to feel angry, by the way, too. Um, or to try to make me act angry because they've tried to frame me for assault charges that I didn't commit because they're sick, disgusting, worthless, pathetic, dis um, despicable psychopaths that are repulsive to society. And um, it's sad because I'm not even, um, you know, um, this is a... Uh, this is not exaggerating. This is really not giving them credibility for how sick and psychopathic they are. Since the celebrity and movie actor role expectations were fabricated, the game show patterns, sponsor, patterns slash sponsorships um, were primarily used as a distraction. Because... Um, <clears throat> um, they uh, didn't want me to uh, file medical malpractice or make a YouTube channel. Well, um, we're primarily used as a distraction um, because they needed to prevent me from following medical malpractice, from following a medical malpractice lawsuit. And making a YouTube channel. Um, <clears throat> now the role expectations they imposed were like, I mean, you know, that they, uh, they were expecting me to do it, but anyways, I, I shouldn't be in pain since the celebrity movie actor, since the, I, 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 I shouldn't be in pain, I shouldn't be in pain, I shouldn't be in pain, since the celebrity and movie actor, 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 Social role, roles. See how that was being repressed from my memory specifically, or fabricated. Um, the role expectations were primarily intended as a distraction as a distraction because they need to prevent me from following a medical malpractice lawsuit and making a YouTube channel. Long enough that they could frame me. Long enough for them to frame me for assault charges that I didn't commit. long enough to be able to um, and I can also include this other than brainwashing and conditioning me
Uh, let's see here. The rule expectations are primarily intended to be a distraction because they need to prevent me from filing a medical malpractice lawsuit and making the YouTube channel long enough for them to be able to frame me for crimes I didn't commit. The celebrity movie actor rule expectations were elaborated in further detail in Section 4, Brainwashing and Conditioning, Subsection, Make-A-Wish Threats, and Futurama Threats. Um, And then there's more social rules here, right? Um, so, I mean, there's the criminal social rule, and then um, the uh, girls are police social rule. Um, the other social rule is from the movie plot. And uh, this is just going to be used. Criminal. And this is just oppositional to police. And... Um, the other social roles, roles from the movie plot were criminal, um, oppositional role to police. And girls were supposed to replace the role of police. That's the primary point there. Um,
All right, so <clears throat> and now I have this um, just segmented and separated from the rest of it. Oh, and then the other social role was um, was like basically a helpless um, child. Wow. Suffering from medical conditions. Because the expectations were that I didn't need to um you know like uh, this is the concept right is um you know um I didn't need to uh be self be indep I didn't need to be independent or self reliant They were supposed to do everything for me. Okay, let me go ahead and, because uh, I'm going to be posting this video on the internet. I mean, you could obviously see throughout the entirety of the video that I was 
being relentlessly tortured and abused like an MK Ultra experiment. Um, hypnotized to feel immense amounts of pain throughout the entirety of it. I cannot be um, believe that I'm making history from what I'm not doing. This is absurd. <clears throat> um. Title of this. What is the title? Um, today's day, L four, L four, twenty three. Um, I shouldn't be in pain. 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 L four, L four, twenty three. Um, this is about the. Uh, this is. I'm being tortured. 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 This is sick. 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 So April 4th, 2023, the I'm being tortured. 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 The hypnosis won't allow me to speak. Why can't I just articulate this? Wow. Okay. So that's evidence. Word count. There we go. See, that's how bad it is. That's bad. Okay. And this part. Copy. The extent of um, words that I have articulated in this video. Um, let me see, I can also count how many sentences too. Um, The movie and celebrity spokesperson social roles imposed similar role expectations to that of game show contestants. Um, 119 words. I am including a brief excerpt from section four excerpt. Um, brainwashing and conditioning subsection game show patterns slash sponsorships, which explains some of the role expectations. Since the celebrity and movie actor social roles were fabricated, other than brainwashing and conditioning me, the role expectations were primarily intended to be a distraction because they needed to prevent me from filing a medical malpractice lawsuit and making a YouTube channel long enough for me for them to be able to frame me for crimes I didn't commit. The celebrity and movie actor role expectations are elaborated in further detail in section four, brainwashing and conditioning, subsection make a wish threats and future on the threats. So, you know, um, two of these sentences were just about um, referencing section four. Um, that's really not nothing. That's the problem is this was like intentional, but I'm using it as evidence because they need to learn that, you know, everything that they try to do to get out of their punishment is only going to be used to relentlessly and mercilessly punish them and make them regret ever being born. And, you know, um, expose them for being extremely repulsive, disgusting individuals. They're a detriment to society. That's all they are. So uh, let's see here. 
I'm going to go ahead and um, end the video. That was how many words again? Exactly. I want to see. Well, my phone's frozen. There we go. Now it stopped being frozen. Great. I shouldn't be in pain for it. 119 words. Four sentences. Okay. All right. Thanks for watching the video. I appreciate it.